everyone welcome to the signal system class in the previous class we discussed the initial value theorem in jet transform today we will discuss the final value theorem in jet transform the final value theorem states that if the jet transform of ft is equal to fz then the limit of ft when t tends to infinity will be equal to limit of z minus 1 times of fz when z tends to 1 let us see the proof of this theorem by shifting theorem we know that limit of z ft plus t z tends to 1 minus limit of z ft when z tends to 1 can be written as limit z tends to 1 z fz minus z f0 minus fz because from shifting theorem we know that z transform of ft plus t can be written as z f z minus z f0 and z transform of ft is equal to f z now we can simplify this equation and it can be written as z minus 1 times of f z minus z f0 limit z tends to 1 now when we substitute this limit in this equation we get limit of z minus 1 times of fz when z tends to 1 and this z is equal to 1 so this will be equal to f0 let the, this be equation number 1 now from the definition of z transform we can write z transform of ft plus t minus z transform of ft can be written as summation n is equal to 0 to k where k tends to infinity f of n plus 1 into t into z to the power minus n minus summation n is equal to 0 to k f of n t z to the power minus n when k tends to infinity that is this term can be written as summation of f n plus 1 t z to the power minus n and this, this term can be written as f of n t into z to the power minus n now let z tends to 1 so we have substituted the limit in this equation z tends to 1 so because z tends to 1 we have substituted the value of z is equal to 1 in this two equation so it will come out to be summation n is equal to 0 to k k tends to infinity f of n plus 1 into t minus summation n is equal to 0 to k f n t when k tends to infinity now for different values of n we can write this equation as f of t minus f0 plus f of 2t minus f of t plus f of 3t minus f of 2t up to f of kt now from this equation we find that these terms will cancel out and we will be left out only with this term f of k plus 1t minus f0 when k tends to infinity now if we substitute the value of k tends to infinity this equation will come out to be f infinity minus f0 let this be equation number 2 now comparing the equations 1 and 2 we have f infinity minus f0 will be equal to limit of z tends to 1 z minus 1 times of fz minus f0 so we can write f infinity, f infinity as limit of ft when t tends to infinity is equal to limit of z tends to 1 z minus 1 times of fz so we have proved this final value theorem